Hello and welcome back to my Magic 3 Isles of Terra. Let's go back to the Cursed Cold Cavern and get everything that we didn't get before. I also gave everyone all the items and um, got a pretty decent boost in AC. Okay, also light would be nice. Yeah, now uh, recording with the Og Vorbis format results in less desync, which is pretty nice. Though sometimes it exists and sometimes it doesn't, it's kind of weird. Okay, so jump. I tried those things out and apparently all of them are in fact um, good. There's no more brew like the aging one that would make anything bad happen to us. Well, aside from, of course, doing a lot of damage. Um, but most of these things actually give you magic resistance. Let's see, who needs that? Magic 7, 7, 5, 7, 20, 25. Okay, so basically Shran needs it, and then whoever has the least resistance overall. Well, no, not you. Yeah, I guess... I guess Hoshi can have it. Okay, but first Shran. Magical flames kindle below the cauldron. Dip your hand in the brew. Black Terror Key! That's probably for the Tomb of Terror. Uh, hmm. Yeah, I'm really running low on inventory space. Mostly due to accessories, because you can equip as many of them as you like, and we're getting a lot of them, so it's kind of, yeah, clogging up all the inventory. Etheric bubbles rise from the Witch's Cauldron. Dip your hand in the brew. You're more resistant to the powers of magic, and unconscious. Well, at least that didn't break anything. And really, minus two HP, it's just barely unconscious. Okay, get up, get up. And yes, oh, 25, not bad. Okay, now Hoshi. Precious Pearl of Youth and Beauty, another one. I still am not really certain where to find the Pirate Queen, but I'm sure we'll run across her at some point. Okay, there's nothing else there. And this place. How about you cast Nature Secure? That's unfortunate, so one nature secure isn't even enough. Come on. And that should be enough for any other ones. Okay. I don't think this leads too much, or does it? Right, the secret room doesn't lead too much because we already got everything from that place. But here, there are two. Theory bubbles rise from the Wishes Cauldron. Morris is into the powers of magic. Yes. 62. Okay, cure again. And... Well, I guess I'll give it to Archer. And another precious pearl of youth and beauty. They're really clogging our inventory further. I probably should look at where to turn these things in. There might even be two places, actually. Okay, um... Yeah, I think the only place that I need to visit now is here. 
most notably, to see what this guy can tell me. Wait, this is... 18, 14, okay. What lives in the winter dies in the summer and grows, grows with its roots upward. Okay, it's Rick's Rigsov. What's R? R is I. Hmm. Really? Oh. in the winter, dies in the summer, and grows with its roots upward. Okay, this is an icicle. Princess Trueberry hol holds the golden alicorn. Yeah, I think this is related to all those pearls. Might be able to actually do that quest at this point. Okay, next is... Uh... That's the Echo one, I already answered it, and this is the last one, I think. Copper Hooves. Uh, wait, 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 it's 27-11. Okay. What is nothing but holes tied to holes, yet it is strong as iron. Zizzerm. Hmm. Okay, what's S? H. Ch. Ch. What can that be? Chair? But that... what? Or is that something else? Okay, what is R then? R is... I. Yes, yeah, so that does look to be a chair, but how does that make any sense? Last letter is M. Oh, chain! Chain. Uh, well, still doesn't make much sense. I mean, it's not holes tied to holes, it's iron tied to iron. And it's not necessarily always strong as iron, too, so it's like, what? The password to raise the sunken island is youth. So this is really something that relates to one quest. Hmm. Okay. Alright, so let's get out of this place. Probably will want to look into this quest right after I find the Castle of Evil. Okay, and let's try nature's gate. Yes, I'm still in time. Actually, wait a minute. Probably want to heal a bit before going to the arena. Then go to the arena and then train. Since it's still the same day, Nature's Gate. Well, that was kind of weird. 
So maybe it's not even related to the day. But it works, so let's just go into the, the arena. Also, maybe save before. So, arena. Let's see what the game suggests we do this time. That does not look very friendly. But if I know the game well enough, I should be okay-ish by casting protection from fire. No, no, it's energy. Yep, Iron Wizard. I think this is the boss of the place. They are found, <laughs> of course, not here. We won't be able to see these guys until much later in the game. Iron Wizard, 200 hit points, 25,000 experience, 30 AC, 50 speed, 2 attacks for 50 damage. As a ranged attack, energy damage, Iron Wizards are great mechanical beasts employed by the Ancients to guard the secret rooms of metal that lie beneath the pyramids. Energy attacks are their great weakness. Oh. So they make energy attacks and they're weak to energy attacks. Okay, that's uh, good to know. So, nature secure. Do you have anything energy based? I don't think you do. So, you can just use sparks. Oh, that worked. You definitely have something energy based. Yeah, this guy did not like that. I did not like that too much. Yep. I think that was the boss of the place. Let's just recast nature's gate if needed. Yep. <laughs> Otherwise it's just bubble men and those guys. <laughs> yeah, bubble men do not have a chance. So yeah, this arena fight kind of useless because uh, we will not be able to find those guys until much later in the game anyway. And this might be everything. Yes, and now everyone got a level. That means it's time to train. Except, of course, not in here. Um, hmm. So everyone is level 14 or more, which means that the second town cannot help us now. So I need to go to Gordon Freeman to train. Okay. So let's do just that. Is the training place the battlement? That sounds like it, but of course it's the wrong time. So how about? Yeah, I would like to deposit some things because we have a lot, and training will take a while. And what's the time? Ah, <sighs> 2 a.m. Really. Well, okay, so let's go back to Fountainhead, then rest. And 
Yes, it's 10 a.m. Good. And deposit everything. So we almost have a million, that's pretty cool. But we do need about 200,000. And 52 jumps will probably be enough. That a bit too much. I think I need twenty thousand, not two hundred thousand. Derp. <laughs> okay. Um. and a train once it stops loading step onto the field if you be brave enough to train with the deadliest of instructors hmm. yeah okay we probably should have more than that. Uh, oh well. So let's train. Okay, Flox is only to level 15. Oh, but also to level 16. Okay. Yeah, just not enough. I guess I'll just have to wait a bit, because once I turn in all of those artifacts, we may very well be able to train again. Okay, so level 17 and 16. Three attacks per round. Four attacks per round. That's pretty nice. Okay. So. No, let's well, save, but also go find the place where the evil castle is. And ideally, once we power up. So let's... Beacon. Set. Go to Fountainhead. Go outside. Oops, 
shot it. <laughs> okay, power up again and get right back. And go to Doom. Right, and from here, the enemies are right here. Just have to go north. And I probably want to visit Princess Trueberry at some point, but uh, maybe not right now. Yeah, so you can see there is ice over there. First save. Then cast Walk on Water. Well, maybe not here, but here. Yeah, that does sound like a better plan. Walk on Water. Archers! And I don't think I can do anything with them. Because shooting... Yeah, doesn't do anything. Well, they cannot shoot us too, so I should be able to just walk up to them. Archers! Archers are... Well... Archers are a class, but also, come on, where's the actual enemy type? There we go, Archer. 100 hit points, 15 AC, 35 speed, 2000 experience, no, 20,000 experience, 4 attacks for 5 to 30 points of damage. Range attack and physical damage. Archers stalk the frozen lands that surround Castle Dragontooth. Yep, exactly. The harsh winter weather has stiffened their countenance to the four elements. Okay. But it didn't do anything for deadly swarms, now did it? Okay, maybe it did. Um, but hey, um, how about pain? Sort of. How about an energy blast? 100 hit points. Wow, okay, so that worked, but could have gone better. Okay, you can just attack then. guys here. Also, what is the description of the area? Korak's notes on E1. Long before the construction of Castle Dragontooth, when serpents still swarmed in serpent woods, explorers of the frozen lands erected statues to honor mythical champions of the attributes of man. Legend says that a special blessing awaits those who pay homage to these champions of long-forgotten myths. Interesting. Are there... Stat boosting things here? I could definitely use some more speed. Okay, nothing else here. It's better to be in the forest if I want to shoot, but then again, all the enemies shoot too, so maybe it's not such a good idea. enemies, but I cannot do anything about them. And there no longer are enemies. I see someone there. A pile of items lies buried in snow. Cover them? Save first. And let's see what happens. <laughs> I 
Ouch. That hurt. We did get a lot of everything. What? Acidic gambler splint mail of vaccination. The heck is that? Uh, but we are so full of items, that is incredible. Probably should have gone to a uh, store. Yeah, I really need to get somewhere else. In fact, I can even use Lloyd's Beacon. After all, I really don't want to lose any items just because our inventory is full. Uh, but I do need to find a shop where I can sell all of those things. And the place... Yeah, I might as well go to Fountainhead again. And then rest until the shop is open. Sell things I really don't need. Bronze gauntlets, silver gauntlets, more silver gauntlets, iron belt, the rod of sleeping. Then I don't need this coin of silence. And those I will keep. And these are pretty good. These are pretty good. So that's probably all. Now let's uh, get powered up again. Continue on our way. To fight more archers. That's the wrong place to go. So all of these squares are not for now. Huh. That's a lot of archers. Well, let's try a deadly swarm again. Maybe it will work better this time. Yeah, that worked much better. That worked quite well too. Energy Blast. And look at that! An Evil Ranger! We've seen these guys before. They bark. Yep. <laughs> okay, more deadly swarms. More pain. about you can a fireball. Yeah, that worked. And since these guys shoot, might as well just go forward. Okay, 
can use an energy blast. Oh, really? Well, fine. Saw an evil ranger and then he went away somewhere. Oh, two of them. Okay. Fireball. Double kill. Wow, that is a lot of golden gems. Ready enough to train. Even for another level. Okay, how does this work? Probably want to shoot somewhere. And then do this, yes. Ow. What did you do that for? Okay, nature skewer. Pain. And I guess even that ball should work, okay. Yeah, so they are resistant to element, but not all that much. Oh. I did not expect that. But okay. Oh, that is a lot of them. Another nature secure. And how about another energy blast? And there is another one. But our arrows cannot go through. But there can. Cheating much. <laughs> okay. So now just attack. And you can use pain. Energy blast and attack. More of them. Wait, that actually hit? What? That makes no sense. Come on. <laughs> Huh, got one with pain. And finally an energy blast. Really, there's more. Hi there. Seriously, people, stop attacking. I would like to get your items. Fireball. Double kill. How about you cast a fireball there? They come from, come on. Double kill. Ow. And now another fireball. Yes, finally. 17,000 gold, 375 gems. Nice. Alright, so that will be all. And next time we will look into all of those uh, statues there. So, see you all then. Later.